Okay, so I want to um, talk about PyInstaller, that is a tool that enables you to make a, a, an exe file for Windows from a, a Python uh, um, a Python file. So let me show this example here, this little this little memory game that I'm making and it's written in Python so this is the code and it has just uh, okay I just done something about my installer but I want to explain uh, that how you can get an error and I finally get what was wrong and why do the exe file do not work um, did not work in, while the, the Python file worked um, so this is this is the code, just 200 lines of code, and that, as you have seen, it works. So now I'm gonna to uh, delete the previous um, distribution here thing that I made. And okay, I wanna make a new Py installer. Uh, by the way, to install Py installer, you have to just go in the command command line and uh, do pip install py installer if I remember well but I have another video where I talk about installing py installer uh, now I want to talk about this error uh, that is done uh, by because uh, it the, the when you run the exe file there is this error that says that it cannot load um, for example this click mp3 or this org file and so on and I was struggling with this error I I thought at first that and I tried something on the internet trying to change the way um, the way that I um, write here you know this slash double slash right slash or left slash and I tried to change also uh, to don't not put it into a path and so on but it didn't work uh, until I remembered that I had uh, previously uh, Pine Solar worked on uh, some other version of my uh, programs and games and I went to check them there to see why those files um, for those files Py installer worked and so I finally realized that I use their uh, just wave files instead of mp3 and for some reason while the Python um, program works with mp3 and uh, og file um, when I create the exe file with Py installer it says it can find the file so I substituted the uh, uh, mp3 with the uh, WAV file, like in this case, and I made the use it by installer like this. To use by installer, after you install it, you use you go in py in installer. And then you write the name of the file that you want to. And it is this chimp 101.py and if you want to have just an exe file without any other file in it, you go and do one file like this dash dash one file and chimp 101 okay now it's it's packaging making its, its thing and um, I haven't found this um, this method on on internet even if I try to fix this error and nobody told about this thing about the wave file uh, um, that do not cause error in the exe file that is being uh, packaged so let me now it's ending here I want to see if the exe file will work so and a thing that I have to do is just I have some images in this and I just have this file here this click wave file to put into the directory where the files are because there are ways to make uh, 
by installer to do this work but I do it manually uh, to make it quick and so in, in here inside there is this image and now let's see if this work this works let me open it and here it is and okay and it works and so um, this is if you if you encounter an error and says that it can load an mp3 on a nog can find the path but you have used the right path um, don't waste your time uh, changing this uh, this in, to this this is good to for to use it in on Unix Linux etc on the Mac OS and but because you just for some reason at least in my on my computer the mp3 um, works when uh, I don't com compile it package them into an exe file it works normally in the normal code because uh, but uh, it doesn't work when I on the exe file that I package with the pi installer and so um, if you encounter this error use WAV files only to make to use PyInstaller to create an exe file in Windows.